Hi, CJ, uh, Dr. Lang. Thank you very much for doing this quick interview with me. Uh, I know you had been planning to attend our uh, presentation and speak live, so I do appreciate that you are doing it this way and I can share your uh, interest in the Beamer technology with the larger audience that we, will, that we have here on Saturday. Okay, I'll give the microphone, so to speak, to you. Okay, if you would just elaborate how you came across it, what you were seeing yourself personally, and uh, what the decision was on putting it into your practice. Thank you, Bettina. Um, hello, everybody. I'm Dr. Christopher Lang uh, with Spokane Orthopedics. Uh, uh, we are a private four-man orthopedic group uh, located right across the street from Holy Family Hospital. Um, I specialize in sports medicine, uh, specifically knee and shoulder uh, arthroscopic surgery. Um, first encountered uh, the Beamer uh, through my wife and Bettina uh, about two years ago. Um, my uh, and first off, I do want to apologize for not being there. Uh, I between a six-hour uh, course at Whitworth and my teenage son's birthday party, I overcommitted for Saturday. So. Uh, um, but uh, I did want to share this uh, exciting technology with you and what my personal experience has been um, and uh, our expectations for what we're, how we're going to be using it in the office. Um, so about two years ago, my wife, who uh, experiences a lot of uh, chronic back and neck pain and fibro fibromyalgia type uh, symptoms, um, uh, was introduced to Bettina and started going to her wellness center and uh, came back and told me about this place where she lays on a mat and listens to nice music and uh, uh, you know and it, it sounded uh, a little too good to be true um, uh, I started wondering in fact whether they were uh, smoking something down there this is Washington State after all but uh, she clearly had less pain every time she'd come home from these treatments uh, I started noticing a more of a consistent uh, better sleep uh, less need for needing a massage uh, at night um, for that same purpose and and it was really making a huge difference um, so we decided to invest in the machine and bought uh, a beamer uh, we got the new one right the beamer pro uh, mm -hmm. and um, uh, we have had that at home uh, brought it home about the same time that I was actually scheduled for a shoulder replacement surgery. I've been suffering with uh, uh, glenohumeral shoulder arthritis for 20 years, progressively worse, um, to the point that I literally, uh, bone spurs would lock together if I reached into my back pocket to get my wallet and I couldn't move my arm. So um, I had the surgery for that purpose, had been needing ibuprofen daily for years up to that point. Um, my recovery, and I've been used used the Beamer uh, once or whenever I could, twice a day, um, faithfully since the time of that surgery, which was uh, uh, March 8th of last year. So it's been about a year and a half. Um, my therapist put me in the top 5% of anybody he's seen recover from such a surgery. I have absolutely full range of motion. I played tennis a month ago for the first time in over 20 years, uh, an hour and a half of tennis. A little smart doctor goes out and does that the first time um, and had no pain afterward. Um, swim uh, a mile every Sunday morning um, uh, and, and it really led to, to a, a great recovery. Um, most noticeably is the other arthritic shoulder which really needs to have the same surgery. Uh, I have not taken ibuprofen for that either for a year and a half. Um, so it, it really has made a big difference. Uh, again, my wife's had a great recovery. She runs almost like a, a little ministry at our house. Almost any neighbor or friend or person she meets at the gym that complains of a tendonitis or chronic pains, she's bringing them over to the house. And um, we have really seen tremendous changes. We've got a gentleman uh, up the street with uh, bilateral unrepairable rotator cuff tears and chronic arthritis and had chronic hip bursitis. The hip bursitis is completely gone after just a few weeks of treatment. Um, the shoulders uh, are significantly better, functions not dramatically better, obviously has no rotator cuffs, but the pain level is much, much less. Um, uh, we've had other friends, fibromyalgia, chronic contractions of their hands, uh, just a handful of treatments and dramatic improvement both in the pain levels and in the function. Um, so this is very promising. Um, so 
uh, so promising that we decided to purchase one here in our office. We did so just a few months ago. Um, we are in a transition period with regards to space and some new partners, so we don't have a, a large amount yet of um, anything more than anecdotal stories yet about treating patients here in the office. Uh, I'm hoping next time we have a seminar of this nature we'll have some real, real data to present. Um, one patient uh, who is actually, uh, she's an uh, inspirational speaker for uh, Saucony and has run 270 marathons. Uh, she was about six weeks post-op from a knee scope and ran another marathon and came back and her other knee had developed a bad case of tendonitis and uh, calf strain, uh, muscle strain, from kind of favoring the other leg. Uh, two treatments, pain completely gone. Uh, and she ran a marathon the next week. So pretty uh, amazing stuff. Uh, and so we're very, very excited about this. Uh, I can't speak much to other applications that have to do with more medical conditions, but when it comes to orthopedic problems, especially muscle pain, uh, whether it's uh, acute overuse or chronic uh, pain, um, nerve pain, uh, joint pain from arthritis, uh, wound healing especially, with the uh, documented 33% uh, increase in the microcirculation. This is really exciting to see what this may do for healing in diabetics who have uh, foot ulcers, wounds, uh, wound problems after uh, ankle fractures and foot fractures, which is a very common problem. Um, so uh, we're gonna be sending our uh, therapy patients post-operatively once they are done with PT over four Beamer treatments. Um, initially free and then a certain number of weeks into the treatment so if they want to continue that then we can go on a, on a per treatment basis but that's um, that's uh, how we're planning to use this here as we move forth in the future uh, just wanted to share with you uh, what my experience has been and what our thought process was and why we decided to uh, to make the, the leap and, and bring a beamer to our, our practice so, um, hopefully again we'll have more hard data and more uh, extended recovery uh, stories from more patients here uh, the next time we have a seminar of this nature. Um, and again, I apologize, I can't be there to, to answer questions at this time. I uh, hope you have a great time at this uh, seminar and uh, everybody uh, get out and buy a Beamer. So, thanks. Can, can I ask you a quick, quick question? Um, is, is the staff or the other doctors, are they using the Beamer also here in the uh, office? We, we are. In fact, we, we had probably within the first couple of weeks we had it. Uh, the, the staff was kind of sneaking in and getting treatments uh, <laughs> almost around the clock. So um, that has been pretty common uh, and uh, has been fairly effective from what I, the feedback I've gotten. Uh -huh. And what about your colleagues, your do the other doctors? Uh, the other guys are fairly busy. I haven't seen them jump on it yet, although I think Dr. Bone might have treated his, uh, his back pain uh -huh. with that uh, a couple of times. But, um, but I will sneak in a treatment here and there when things get slow briefly in the office. And so. Yeah. Any, any interest on their part of possibly also getting a Beamer in their homes? Uh, I, I'm not sure. I think okay. when they start having their aches and pains treated and see that it works, that uh, we're more likely to, to yeah, see that. Wonderful. Yeah. yeah, because uh, in, in Europe, over 90% of the physicians uh, also have a Beamer in their homes oh, wow. that have it in their practice. Yeah. Yeah, it's a very large percentage. Well, thank you very much, uh, Dr. Lang. I really appreciate the time. And the, the next uh, symposium that we put on, we hope to see you live. Oh, well, <laughs> that'll be my pleasure. I've just okay. got to plan better in advance. Yes. Thanks. <laughs> okay, here's a quick look at his busy office. And we have also our posters up there and some Beamer brochures here in the waiting area. And now we're going to stop it.